The need for additional trackage for railroads and transits is increasing, and so is the need for a cost-effective method to install these new ties and rail. Harsco Rail responded to this need by introducing its latest model NTC new track construction machine. The machine can lay new track with up to 12 degree curves, 150 meter radius, and up to 18 degree curves, 1000 meter radius, under certain conditions. This unit lays new ties, threads in new rail, clips the rail to the ties, and leaves behind high quality track with precise tie spacing. Propelled by an auxiliary power source, in this case a Caterpillar D953, the new track construction machine requires only five operators and installs an average of 500 ties per hour. The actual track construction consists of threading new rail, placing the concrete cross ties properly spaced on the new road bed automatically, threading the rail onto the ties and fastening the clips. Let's take a closer look at the five operator stations required on the new track construction machine. One operator is required to operate the auxiliary power source. The new rail, which was previously positioned along the right-of-way, is threaded through the rail guides located at the front of this unit. Steering of the unit is controlled by an operator using a handheld device to keep the sighting mechanism over a plumb line. This plumb line is positioned prior to work commencing. Actual steering is accomplished by the smaller tack track located at the front of the unit. The main control operator is responsible for monitoring the conveyor systems and the tie drop mechanism. After the rail passes through the rail guides located at the front of the cat, it is guided inward to a gauging station. The final placing of the rail on the new ties is controlled by an operator who guides the rail onto the tie seat. He is also responsible for the proper alignment of the track. A self-propelled gantry requiring one operator keeps the ties supplied to the conveyor systems. Picking up 22 ties at a time, the gantry moves to the tie receiving conveyor, deposits the ties, and returns to the tie supply cars for another load. Tie cars are equipped with auxiliary rails which form a continuous running rail for the gantry. Pivoting extensions between the cars allow the gantry to operate on curves. After being deposited by the gantry, the ties move via a conveyor system to the tie drop area. The ties are discharged from the tie placement mechanism and are precisely spaced on the roadbed. A calibrated diameter distance wheel controls the tie spacing using circumferential measurements to signal tie drop activity. Spacing of the ties is adjustable to suit customer requirements. After the ties have been deposited on the subgrade, a tie guide properly aligns the tie to prevent skewing.
The clipping is carried out by a nipper clipper mechanism located near the rear of the machine. The track is now ready for ballast and surfacing operations. Logistics plays an important role in this operation. Concrete cross ties have been strategically placed along the right of way. These ties are then loaded onto the empty tie cars and the loaded cars are moved to the NTC for installation. After being coupled to the NTC, the running rails are installed and the safety lock secured before work commences. Arsco Rail's new track construction machine. Quick, efficient, and cost effective. These units are currently working in the UK, Italy, Saudi Arabia, and Australia, as well as the USA. Contact Arsco Rail now to find out more about saving money in new track construction projects.